Hello, well, morning everyone. I hope everyone is uh, well, fit and strong today. What we're going to be doing today, we're going to do a full body workout. Right, not much equipment needed, only a set of dumbbells and a kettlebell and a 5 meter water bottle if you want, or you could use a normal dumbbell or kettlebell. All right. It's um, eight exercises. Each exercise is 30 seconds working time and a 15 second break. Anything from three to four rounds out, you know the story, after each full completed round, a minute to two minute break depending on your recovery. I'm going to set my timer. And then we're going to start with the first exercise, up and down plank. Alright guys, getting ready. Remember, 3 seconds working time and a 15 second break. And away we go, up and down plank. There we go, it's only for 30 seconds ladies and gents. I know it's a tough one, we'll get through it. There we go. If you really are struggling, you can put your knees on the ground. But I don't think you'll be uh, needing to do that. There we go, 30 seconds. Two, one, excellent, right, from here, 15 second break, then we're going to go on to oblique reaches. So it's a crunch position, and you're going to reach over from left to right, trying to touch those ankles, working your obliques. Take your time with it, make sure that your lower back is constantly on the ground. There we go, 30 seconds. Try to reach as far as you can. Work in those, work in the sides, the obliques. There we go, keep it going. Two, one, and stop. All right, perfect. Right from here, we're gonna grab that water bottle, a five liter water bottle. If you haven't got, you can use a kettlebell or your dumbbells. We're gonna do a sumo. High pull, so you get the legs nice and wide to work the inner thigh. You're going down and coming right up there. Make the elbows come up higher than the weight. All right, so lead with the elbows. Coming up under the chin, squatting down, and squeezing your bum at the top, pushing with the heels. There we go, pushing your bum out, working the inner thighs. There we go, and the glutes. and shoulders two one and stop perfect right from here we're going to be doing thrusters so still a squat position with an overhead press above your head i'm going to be using the dumbbells on this one right 30 seconds squatting down and working above your head keep it going looking good make sure the form is correct pushing your bum out keep it arching the lower back Chest out, tummy tucked in, chin up. There we go, keep it going. Excellent. Keep it going, 30 seconds. Breathing in, exhaling at the top. Breathing in, exhaling at the top. There we go. Right, all right. From here, we're going to do a side lunge into a wood chopper. All right, I'm going to use a kettlebell. You can use a dumbbell. You're going to go down to the side and come across your shoulder. So down to the side and above your shoulder. Look where the weight's going, over your shoulder. Pushing your bum out on the bent leg. So you work the inner thigh and the glutes. There we go. Make sure you push your bum out and go back on the heel on that bent leg. There we go. Legs nice and wide. Makes it easiest for the for the form. That's it. All right, 30 seconds. Right, 15 second break. We've got the other side to do. All right, nice and wide with the legs. Make sure that leg bends. Push the bum out and then go over the shoulder. That's it. So you can work the bum. The more you bend your leg, the more the bum's going to work. That's it, keep it going, looking over that shoulder. 
30 seconds. Nice, keep it going. Keep it nice and strong. Form nice. There we go. Three, two, one, and stop. Great, from here we're gonna grab the dumbbells, get into a sit-up position. I'm gonna hook my legs around the, uh, the leg of the table, just easier to lift. And we're gonna do a, a sit-up bicep curl. There we go. Excellent, curling up at the top. It's best to hook your legs into something, be uh, able to lift up easier. Put a little strand on the back. There we go, and curling up. That's it, working the biceps, working those abdominals. There we go. Breathing in, exhale at the top. Breathing in, exhaling at the top. And stop, great. Right from here, we're gonna do a close grip push-up. I'm gonna keep the knees on the ground for this one. But gents, if you wanna do a full one, a full push-up, close grip push-up for triceps, more than welcome to. There we go. All the way down to the bottom, guys, and up to the top. There we go, squeezing those triceps. Chin going over your hands, there we go. Right over. Your hands are ending up at the shoulders, at the bottom. There we go. Going for 30 seconds, squeezing those triceps. Looking good. Two, one, and stop. Right, we've got one last exercise to do. It's a stiff-legged into a bent over row, a back row. Remember, push the bum out, work in the back of the legs. Push the bum out, knee slightly bent, row, and come up to the top, push your hips forward, squeeze the bum. Row, come up, squeeze the bum at the top. There we go, you're working the back and you're working your hamstrings. Feel that stretch at the back of the leg, working your shoulder blades and squeezing back. That's it. Don't forget to squeeze the bum at the top. There we go. Two, one, and stop. Great stuff, awesome. Right, there we go guys. Eight exercises. 30 seconds working time and a 15 second break. After each full completed round, a minute to two minute break, then go straight on to the next round. Have a super one guys, train hard, keep well and safe, and enjoy the program. See you all tomorrow. Good run.